Hi everyone, today we are going to make a radar system and we are going to use the ultrasonic sensor and the servo motor and you can click the link in the description below to how to write the code and how to work the ultrasonic sensor and the servo motor. Now let's start. I already attached the ultrasonic sensor and servo motor like this way by using hot glue. Then I paste double side tape under the servo motor like this way. Now I'm gonna take four jumper wires male to female. Then I'm gonna take the orange jumper wire and connect it to the VCC in my ultrasonic sensor. Then I'm gonna take the green jumper wire and connect it to the trigger. Then I'm gonna take the yellow wire and connect it to the echo. Then I'm gonna take the blue wire and connect it to the ground. Now I want to hold the servo motor so I am going to paste this like this way. Now I am going to take 3 jumper wires male to male then I am going to connect this like this way. Now I'm going to connect the servo motor to the Arduino board. Now I'm going to take the red jumper wire and connect it to the 3.3 volt VCC in my Arduino board. Then I'm going to take the yellow jumper wire and connect it to the ground in my Arduino board. Then I'm going to take the orange jumper wire and connect it to any digital pin in my Arduino board. I connect it to the 8 pin in my Arduino board. Now I'm gonna connect the ultrasonic sensor to the Arduino board. Now I'm gonna take the orange jumper wire and connect it to the 5 volt PCC. Now I'm gonna take the blue jumper wire and connect it to the ground in my Arduino board. Then I am going to take the yellow jump wire that is echo and connect it to the 9 pin in my Arduino board. Then I am going to take the green pin that is trigger and connect it to the 10 pin in my Arduino board. Now I am going to include the library. Now you can watch how to include new pin and servo libraries in the previous videos in the description below. Now I am going to define my pins. I'm gonna define servo pin 8, then I'm gonna define echo pin 9. Now I'm gonna define trigger pin 10. Then I'm gonna define start point 0. Then I'm gonna define end point. 180 now I'm gonna create an object the object's name is my server now I'm gonna create a new object the object's name is my sensor then I'm writing in the brackets trigger pin and echo pin Now I am writing in the void setup serial dot begin nine thousand six hundred. Then I am writing my server dot attach serpin. Serpin is connected to the eighth pin. 
then I am writing my server dot write start point the start point is zero now I am writing in the void loop a for loop 0 to 180 you can click in the link in the description below to how to write the for loop Then I am writing my server dot write x. Then I am putting a delay for 30 milliseconds. Then I am writing serial dot print x. Then I am writing to print a comma. Then I am writing serial dot print my sensor dot pink underscore centimeter that means read centimeter then print centimeter then I am writing serial dot print a dot now I am writing another for loop 180 to 0 but it is same as the first for loop. Now I am going to upload it. Uploading. Uploading is done. No errors. Now I am going to open the serial monitor. Now the variables will print like this way. Now I am going to close it. Now you can download this application. I will put it in the link in the description below. Then you have to copy this code and open the application. Then you have to paste the code. Then you can change your port number. My port is COM7, so I'm gonna change it to COM7. Then I'm gonna press run. When I run it, there is an error because COM7 is used by the serial monitor. So I need to go back to the code and upload it. Uploading. Uploading is done, no errors, but don't open the serial monitor, then go back to the application, then run it. See, it is working now. Now, when I keep an object in front of the sensor, it will turn red in the radar. You can see in my screen. And it is very simple to understand and very easy to write the code.
that's all for today you can watch my videos and subscribe and click the bell notification thank you for watching my videos have a nice day